Welcome to the Digital Disciple YouTube page. I'm Sean. And I'm Andrea. You can call her digital. And you disciple. If you've ever had a chance to take a look, check out our Digital Disciple podcast. But today, we're going to be in the kitchen making some Captain Crunch chicken tenders. Oh my gosh. We're gonna, we got a little bit of buffalo sauce. We got some sriracha. We even rounded up some Chick-fil-A sauce. Shh. Don't tell Chick-fil-A. It's my wife's favorite. We hope you enjoy this awesome recipe and we're gonna get into some awesome cooking with our air fryer. We wanna wish you guys a Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Feliz Navidad. A Happy New Year. And we just pray that 2021 will be better than 2020. We can't see how it wouldn't be, uh -huh. but we pray that this video and recipe is a blessing to you. Oh, by the way, we're cooking it in our Ninja Foodie Smart Food cooker thing. Grill XL. Grill XL. It's got like a lot of stuff yeah, after it. a lot it. of names. Bottom line, it's, it's the amazing. Ninja Foodie Grill XL. XL. And uh, it cooks really good. It even has a thermometer you put in the meat so it, yep. it tracks the temperature so you know exactly when it's ready. And you can cook and it's healthy. You don't need a lot of oils. You can put vegetables in there, chicken, steak, and it's it can make the perfect steak. You literally can tell it you want your steak cooked medium. Put the thermometer in there and it will cook it for you. You can walk away, watch TV or whatever, and then come back. What about the lobster we did? Oh, we did lobster. It was Amazing. incredible. We did scallops already. The scallops were awesome. Yeah, that's right. So, but today it's going to be Captain Crunch. Enjoy! Chicken tenders. All right, welcome to the Digital Disciple with Sean and Andrea. I'm Sean. And I'm Andrea. And today we are going to be cooking with Sean and Andrea. And we are going to make one of my favorite treats that I used to get at Planet Hollywood. I think the only Planet Hollywood that we're familiar with is the uh, one up in Orlando right now. I think it's owned by uh, Guy Ferrari now. But uh, one, of their, one of their favorite things that they had on the menu was the Captain Crunch Corn Flakes. So this is just going to be a list of the ingredients. Um, as you'll see on the left, you got Corn Flakes, you got Captain Crunch, you have a couple of my favorite seasonings, uh, butt rub, cayenne pepper, we're going to turn some in the buffalo. Um, we got eggs, and uh, in, a, in the bowl right here, I've already mixed up the eggs and some milk, and uh, we have some chicken. And we have the mixture, which is uh, Captain Crunch. It's basically uh, two-thirds two Captain Crunch and one-third uh, Corn Flakes. And what you're going to do is you're going to put them in a Ziploc bag, and you're going to use this little thing, and you're going to smash them while they're in the bag. Um, also, we kind of changed up the menu a little bit. Some people actually put flour in this, and some people do not. Um, I chose to get some of this... Uh, some of this keto wheat flour, and we're gonna give this a try on maybe half of them, and we'll go from there. Also, you're not supposed to use, um, really, you're not supposed to use olive oil in our air fryer, and that's one of the big things that I didn't tell you yet, is we're actually gonna make this in the air fryer. So I got some avocado oil, and we got some salt and pepper, and uh, we got some milk. Um, that's pretty much all the list of the ingredients. So what we are going to do is I'm going to, you know, we're going to basically, you're just going to take the chicken, okay, and you're going to dip it in the egg. And then you're going to put it in the batter. And you're going to shake it off. And then from there, you're going to put it in the Captain Crunch mix. You just kind of put it on there. I don't know if I like how the flour's working on that, but that's basically what we're, what we're gonna do. So, like I said, we're gonna try some without the flour, and we're just gonna put it straight into Captain Crunch. That one looks better. And I think that one looks better to me, the flour. Yeah. Some people like the flour, some people don't like the flour. But really, it's just a matter of putting the chicken in the egg, in the eggs. And it's just a, it's two eggs mixed with a little bit of milk, and then you just throw it into the Captain Crunch and the uh, corn flakes, and you just mix it up. 
So we're gonna put this on pause until we make all of these and we're gonna heat up the air fryer and then we're gonna come back. All right. All right, we got all the chicken coated with egg and cornflake and Captain Crunch. And this is gonna be our Captain Crunch chicken tenders cooked in a Ninja Foodie Smart Food Grill XL. All right, as you can see, the Ninja Foodie Grill XL is now ready for us to add food. All right, we're gonna, the, the air fryer is ready for us. We got the uh, Ninja Foodie XL grill, and we got it in air fryer mode. And we are putting these in here now, and you'll see they're all covered in the Captain Crunch. And you might have some fall off, you know, just fit as many as you can in here. Um, some recipes actually say you're supposed to put them in the fridge for a little bit, but we're not gonna wait for the fridge. We're gonna, my wife is hungry right now. Very hungry. So we're gonna, Put these in and we're gonna see how they how they do and um, we're gonna put a little seasoning on it I always like to put a little bit of this stuff called butt rub on stuff so we're gonna just sprinkle some of that on there um, you can put the seasoning on before or you can put the seasoning after we're gonna put a little salt and we're gonna put a little pepper on here and uh, we're gonna close it and we're gonna let it cook and be right back. And if you've never experienced a Ninja Foodie Grill, this is basically what they sound like. They can be a little bit loud. This is the air fryer part. This is the air fryer. The grill itself sounds a little loud too. If you look close on the screen, you can actually see right there where it says air crisp. And so we have it in air crisp mode right now. And uh, it's probably not gonna take the full 19 minutes we're just gonna let it cook and uh, we'll be back um, a good rule of thumb I believe the temperature for the chicken tenders should be 175 and I may actually stick the thermometer in there while we're uh, while, we're, while we're off camera so the feature for the ninja foodie grill excels that it has a thermometer and you can um, choose what category if it's beef chicken or fish and you insert the thermometer and it tells you the current temperature and your target temperature. It's a pretty cool feature. That is cool. So you don't have to guess or cut it. I love that feature. And we'll be back. All right, we're still cooking here and just waiting on the grill. You look over, we got some of our sauces ready now. You got a flip, babe. Oops. And, uh, I'm being told it's time to flip, so we're going to end up flipping these. And actually, they're starting to look pretty good already. Mm -hmm. so we're going to flip them. Some say it's not necessary to flip if it's the same color on the other side, Oi. just because uh, it's an air crisper, so it actually crisps from underneath too. But you can try and flip it if you can get in there. I don't want a plenty of that. We'll leave it off. That's the problem. All right, we got one that's got the, the thermometer in it that we're not gonna touch. And uh, we're gonna close it back up. If you look over to the side, uh, we got some sauces over here. Uh, we got one of my favorite srirachas that you can get at um, Whole Foods. And then I found this buffalo sauce that's, uh, I think I found it, found it at Publix. It's called Noble Made. And then a lot of people don't know you can get this, but you can actually get Chick-fil-A sauce, the secret sauce, and get it at Publix. My wife really likes it. So we're gonna finish up here, and uh, we'll be back when we, when we get it done. We are getting close to it being done. As you'll notice, the temperature is at 153 right now, and it's supposed to go to 170. So we should have the first batch of Captain Crunch chicken tenders with some buffalo sauce, sriracha, or Chick-fil-A sauce finished shortly uh, with our butt rub seasoning that we get at Publix or Whole Foods. Yeah, just a little tip too. If when you open it up and you notice there's some light areas that look like they haven't browned and you want them to brown, you just spray it a little bit with this avocado oil. 
and uh, that will help it brown up nice for you. All right, we are being told that it says get your food, that it's done. And so we're gonna take a piece here, my wife's gonna cut it. I'm gonna put it right here. I'm gonna take a look at it. I'll let you guys see. Let's see the inside, baby. It's perfect. It looks perfect. So again, this, this air fryer, the Foodie XL Smart Food Grill um, by Ninja has the, ow. Wait. Um, don't touch that, it's hot. <laughs> has this temperature thermometer that you put in there. And it basically cooks the food. You don't even have to really pay too much attention to it. But we're gonna, we're gonna take this out and we're gonna put more in. So. Looks good though. And you can actually make this if you wanted. You could have just a Captain Crunch. You don't need to have the, the cornflakes, but the uh, recipe actually calls for cornflakes. So, just to give you an idea. You gotta be careful, because it wants to come off. We made some of these with flour. We made some without the flour. It's really preference how thick you like your batter. If you look at this one over here, you can tell this one's got a lot of batter on it. Yeah, it does. So, but then you can see this one's kind of, you can see the baldness coming through, you can see the chicken coming through. We didn't put too much on there. So it's really preference on your end. How much uh, Captain Crunch do you really want in your food? Can you put the thermometer back in? So we're gonna put the thermometer back in if I can touch it. No, actually it cooled off pretty good. And I'm just gonna stick it in the biggest piece of chicken that's in here. And I'm gonna close it. And we're gonna give it some more time. All right, well, we're, we're enjoying some. You see this one piece right here that's really thick. I double battered it. I actually put it in the egg, put it in the flour, and I put it back in the egg again, and then I put it in the uh, Captain Crunch. So it's, it's a little bit thicker it's on there, crunchy. and it's crunchy, and you can just see how perfectly cooked it is. It's so juicy. It's nice and juicy. Mmm. Let me cut it. So, I haven't seen anybody cook this in a Ninja Foodie Grill XL yet. This is with some buffalo sauce on it. So good. Mmm. All right, our second batch just came up, and just like before, it not notified us that it was at 170 degrees. And you can see, like this piece right here, you can see is crispy on that side and the other side. The air fryer tends to crisp both sides, but you can flip them over. And, uh, oh man, I lost a little piece of that. That's gonna be good. Um, but we're, we're pretty much done. And we've already enjoyed some while uh, we were off camera. We're just gonna cook this for a couple more minutes and then we will say goodbye. Well, we hope you've enjoyed the Captain Crunch chicken, chicken tenders, tenders cooked in the Ninja Foodie, XL. Grill, XL, <laughs> grill. thingamajig. We hope you guys had a lot of fun with us, learning new ways to cook. We're gonna co create more recipes in our Ninja Grill. We absolutely love it. It's great. Um, it's the best of both worlds. It's like barbecuing outside. You can literally feel like you're barbecuing and you do it inside. It's like the best investment. It is. And we're having a blast with it. Um, in addition to that, make sure you check out our Digital Disciple podcast. You can find it on anchor.fm. It's on Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, Spotify. Um, it's pretty much everywhere right now. There's only like six episodes, but we're going to be working on more where we talk about things that relate to marriage, relate to uh, relationships, and just growing in a relationship with God. Um, in addition to that, check out our website at mydigitaldisciple.com. Mydigitaldisciple.com. And all the information will be on there. Anyway, we love you guys. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. We love you guys. <laughs> Have a great night. God, God bless you and you. Happy New Year. Bye. Feliz Nuevo. Happy Wednesday. 
I just wanted to come on really quick for a quick live. Hello. Um, we're gonna just wait for a few friends to join in, babe. Don't do it yet. Don't don't tell them yet. Um, we want. <laughs> we're just gonna wait for a few people to join in. Uh, we wanted to wish everyone a merry early Merry Christmas Eve, and we have a special treat to show you all. Um, it's something that we just did together that was a lot of fun. <laughs> There's all his toys back there. Uh, anyway, so if, if you're watching the replay, um, if you don't see the red light button, we're not live anymore. <laughs> but we want to tell you about something really cool that we just did. Uh, we did our um, cooking episode for our Digital Disciple group. And um, we used our Ninja Foodie Grill XL. XL. That's amazing. Amazing. Come this way a little more. Oh, sorry, in. sorry. So uh, it's the best investment. It's an air fryer. It's a, um, a grill. And it does other stuff, too, that we haven't quite yet figured out. Um, thank you all for coming in. We just wanted to show something to you guys really quick. This is Sean's, um, well, that's where our desk area is, where he has all his fun toys. Ha. <laughs> and our gorgeous Christmas tree. But we wanted to just come on really quick to let you guys know, to give you a heads up, um, that we um, just we just created a video for our... What's this for? It's a special recipe that we did. What is, what is this? Have you guys ever cooked with that? Have you ever been to Planet Hollywood? There used to be one in Fort Lauderdale on 17th Street Cogsway, once upon a time. And that's where I first had Captain Crunch... Chicken tenders. Chicken tenders. Uh, and, so we uh, did our own take on it, and we made them in our Ninja Foodie Grill Extra Large. Are we allowed to show them? Uh, no, that's good. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm only allowed to do it this, so you better pause it. So good. We even used um, Chick-fil-A dipping sauce. We had sriracha. Sriracha, buffalo. Okay, so we don't want to tell you guys too much, but look out for our video uh, on YouTube. It's going to drop on YouTube, youtube.com forward slash digital disciple. Yeah. And uh, we haven't put all the videos together yet, but most likely maybe tomorrow or something, I'll have them up there on Christmas Eve. And uh, we wanted to wish you guys a Merry Christmas. Yes, a early Merry Christmas. Hey, Mary Jo. Feliz Navidad. And Mary Marnette and Lynette <laughs> and Lorraine. <laughs> and so we just wanted to come on real quick to give you guys a heads up that we put this that we're putting this video together. This is our tree. You this guys like our tree? tree. This See, this tree. is the one I went with. Uh, it's fake. First time in my life I've ever had a fake tree, and I love it. And she put these sticks in it. And okay. when I come home from work, these I sticks. smell Christmas tree. And, oh, and, I, and I think it's real, and it's not real. And then I dropped it. It's a little stick. I got it from um, Michael's, I think. And she just got me this little thing. Oh, the baby. He's so cute. This is Gorgar. Gor Gro Gro Groot? Or, no, not Groot. Gorgar, That's something else. Gorgar. Uh, if Curtis Copeland is uh, watching, I'm sure he'll know the answer to what the name or Tim Eakins. Um, but anyway, look for, look for the YouTube video to drop. It's going to be Captain Crunch Chicken Tenders yes. cooked in the Ninja Foodie Grill XL. Air fryer. Air, and, we, air and we used the air fryer. Yeah. And we used a little thermostat thing. And it came, they, came out, they came out awesome. You guys, you put this thermostat in the meat and you click on what meat you want. Hey, Gianna, how are you, girl? So we just um, told them we just made, or we're making a video that we just used Captain Crunch for our chicken tenders. And if you guys don't have a Ninja Foodie Grill XL yet, you gotta get it. It has a thermometer. You put it in the meat, you push if it's chicken, beef, or fish, and then it tells you what temperature and when the meat is ready. There's no more guessing. There no wasn't more... a setting for lobster, but we figured out how yeah. to put lobster in it. No more cutting, because I'm like a freak with chicken. Like, I cut it a million times to check it. Um, hey, Anne-Marie, how are you? So, um, so anyways, that was, it was an investment, but it was definitely worth it. So, yep. um, that's what we just came on. Anyway, the video is out there. You guys can take a look. Hey, we also wanted to uh, let you know, we will be at church tomorrow at oh, yes. Calvary Chapel, Fort Lauderdale. Christmas Eve service will be there at 6 p.m. I'm actually on duty tomorrow, so I have to work. But we will be there tomorrow at 6 p.m. We'd love for you to join us. We have a few other friends that are coming. Gianna, you guys are coming, Gianna right? and Daniel, we'd love you guys to come. 6 o'clock, be there or be square. Anybody else that wants to sit with us, we could. let's take up a whole row since yes. we got social distancing. Be awesome. If we take up a whole entire row, we can all just sit there with our masks off <laughs> and be cool. That'd be fun. Don't tell, don't tell uh, Scott and Nick it, okay? <laughs> um, Anyway, we wanted to invite you guys to that. Yeah. And then, uh, what else, babe? There's something else. No, it was just a Christmas Eve. And then we want to wish everyone a Merry Christmas. Yeah, there's uh, something to else. Check out. Oh, what about the app in the, um, or the website? Um, the website is mydigitaldisciple.com. It's the new website. It's pretty much up and running. 
Um, there's some cool stuff on there. If you look through there on the D Disciple Night page, there's some books that are really good that you know will offer some spiritual growth. Um, there's a couple spiritual tests on there. There's one with the animals, oh, the four yeah. animals, and then there's one on there about a spiritual uh, gifting test that I, that I put the links on there for you guys. Um, in addition to that, there's a Jesus Couples page that we're still working on. Um, and then in addition to that, there's the podcast page, the YouTube page, and then just the, the homepage that it's kind awesome. of addresses it's all so of it. Resources. But take a look at our podcast. We got six episodes on there live right now, and there's a lot of topics the Lord's been laying on our hearts during the holidays. And uh, so we're going to be dropping some more podcasts. Um, you can find it on anchor.fm, uh, Spotify, Apple, Google. Um, it's pretty much everywhere. In addition to that, there is an app, but the app is going to change. The app is Digital Disciple, and it's on Apple and it's on um, Android, and the name's not gonna change, but I'm linking it to the old website right now, so it might look a little different. But anyway, that's pretty much it. Hey, and, uh, Jackie, I see you just jumped on. So um, I'll, so check out our video. We'll let everyone know when we post it, right? Yep, yep. We put it, like, we showed all the ingredients and how we dipped it in the egg and the um, Rice crispy, the Captain Crunch. <laughs> Uh, it's his stuff, baby. The Captain Crunch. Stuff. So be, be, be looking out for the video on how we made this. It was a lot of fun. And um, we hope everyone has a wonderful Merry Christmas. And just have fun, man. And it, it, we're going to make a bunch more videos with the mm -hmm. Foodie Grill. Our YouTube page, we're kind of, it's kind of us doing life. Yeah. So the YouTube page might be um, video of us filming the podcast. It might be video footage of us at the beach or celebrating our five-year anniversary oh, yeah. that we just celebrated. Mm -hmm. uh, it might be silly Snapchat videos. Um, it might even throw some technology in there, some Apple products and stuff. Um, so just, just, you know, if you're interested, please take a look at it and you guys got to ring the bell. You got to like it. You got to follow, subscribe. subscribe, believe it or not, that stuff matters. It's not, we don't get any money or anything from YouTube, but it does matter with regards to whether I can go live on YouTube or not. I don't have a bigger, big enough audience right now. And uh, we did have one video go viral, which allowed us to get our own name as the YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash. Digital Disciple is now the channel. Before that, it was YouTube.com and then a bunch of random letters yeah. and numbers. So cool. it, believe it or not, it makes a difference if you're on there liking stuff. Yeah. And then once you like it, somebody else likes it and it yeah. could go viral again. But we had one that hit, I think, close to 60,000 or 70,000. But um, anyway, we, we love you guys. We pray that 2020 uh, is almost over. Yeah. We're all thankful yeah. for it. And uh, we hope and pray that you all are doing well. Um, we know that it's been hard for a lot of people with the isolation and everything else, but we pray 2021 is going to be better. And uh, this is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it, guys. And just know that God is the God of 2021. He got us through 2020. And I don't know about you guys, but I have not been sick since December of 2019. And all glory and praise goes to God. Mm -hmm. hey, Amen. And I don't think Andrea has either. So, oh, no, my battery's low. Anyway. Hey, um, Anne-Marie's asking which video went viral. And Mary Jo says... Oh, the, vi the, the viral, the, the video that went viral was actually the happy, bir happy birthday one with my daughter in it. It was so and it, random. And it was just me randomly clearing videos off my phone and sticking them on YouTube so that I wouldn't lose the videos and free up so space on my phone. Say, say the YouTube name again one more time. The YouTube name is youtube.com forward slash digital disciple. But if they type in digital disciple, it won't come up. Uh, it might it might come up if you just go there in the search box and type Digital Disciple. But if you type YouTube.com forward slash Digital Disciple, it will take you directly to our homepage. Yeah. So make sure you like and, it I and subscribe. Like, I made like a Digital Disciple banner on it. I think our pictures are on there. And uh, there's a little intro with some, some rocking music and stuff <laughs> going on with it. Um, but anyway, take a look on there if you guys want to. Go ahead and subscribe. And uh, we're going to try and come up with more cooking stuff. We really love our Ninja Foodie XL. Oh, yeah, it has uh, really helped me and Andrea eat low carb Except for and this. well yeah this is not this low is carb <laughs> but i did i did use keto flour uh -huh, so we had the batter on there so a little bit of batter so maybe this was your i don't know 20 carbs or something that you had on on the piece of chicken yeah and then you know had it had the uh, whole whole wheat i think yeah whole wheat. keto flour yeah so but um i might change the name of the if you guys are following the food the food uh group the uh, low carb keto friendly uh -huh. page. I may change it to just eat healthy and that way we can just post healthy things in there. Eat healthy, exercise now, <laughs> something, <laughs> something along that lines. 2021, get, get, get rid of the spare tire in 2021. I don't know. I'm going to change COVID, it. COVID weight. I'm probably going to change it to something 
that allows us to put more stuff on there than just low carb and keto stuff. Yeah. Because I, I kind of like the exercise stuff going on there. Um, I think it's great. My wife likes Sydney Cummings, um, this workout lady, and uh, she's really great. And my wife likes to post her stuff on there. So I think it, I think it's really good. And then we like to post some of our the protein that we like. Mm -hmm. It's a company Ghost. called Ghost. And uh, oh yeah, so, she's asking if we're doing keto. No, we're not doing keto. We're not doing keto. We're doing more of a low carb. Um, well, we're both doing the fasting too. Yeah, as of right now, we're doing intermittent fasting, and um, and then low carb on top of that with. Basically, it's kind of two diets at the same time. So here's the deal. If you break the low carb side, you're still intermittent fasting. Yeah. So we basically cut off and stop eating around seven o'clock at night. And then the next day we eat either around 11 or 12. And that is basically intermittent fasting. Basically, what it allows you to do is take in less calories. Mm -hmm. um, that's the number one thing. Second thing is it does something with your metabolism. Because when you sleep, supposedly that's when you burn mm -hmm. the most calories is when you're actually asleep. And so your body basically still thinks you're asleep because you're not eating anything. You're allowed to have black coffee black. and water and, That's, tea. No. And, and black tea. That's it though. Mm -hmm. um, you know, you can have green tea too, green but, tea, but, 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 but no sugar, no cream, no fake sweeteners, I no artificial sweeteners. And uh, yeah, this one over it. here, I've been bugging her for <laughs> seven years to try black coffee. I just thought I could and never it do took it. me a few years. Anyway, we want to just let you guys know that that's out there. And if, here's, oh yeah, a lot of people ask about the Jesus Couple Group. Um, the Jesus Couple Group, yes, it's for couples. It is for married couples. But singles are welcome to join it as well. Um, as you guys know with the home study, the home study started off as a couples group. And we had a bunch of singles who wanted to come. And a couple of singles were really cute. And Marie. And really cute. And they said, they said, hey, we're single, but we want to be married someday. Can we come? Yes. And we said, yes, you can. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, the principles that we're touching on are all stuff that, you know, not having drama in a relationship. That's healthy for anybody that's even dating. You know, who wants drama in a relationship? You know, if you're dating somebody and they're not a Christian and you are a Christian, stop. Because <laughs> you're going two <laughs> different directions. Work. If you're lie. dating somebody and you're both Christians, but you got all sorts of red flags, the guys, yeah. the guys that are oh. drinking too much, or he's trying to get a little something, something. Um, I would say you want to you want to see those red flags and realize that that's going to be carried over into a marriage someday. But the bottom line is, we we like to joke around with the Jesus couple and say, save the drama for the llama. Uh -huh. And uh, that's probably going to be probably be a first book we ever put uh, out. Yeah. I can see it happening. Yeah, we <laughs> the save the drama for the llama yeah. will be the first book brought to you by Digital Disciple and Jesus Couples. Uh -huh. And uh, we also would like to do, go do like some church presentations and stuff. Maybe yeah, do a married couples know. retreat or something. Yeah. But these are just dreams. We're just dreaming right now. Something, something. You can you can do you can do all <laughs> things through Christ who gives us strength and. Uh, Dream big, man. Yeah. God can do exceedingly abundantly above all you ask, think, or imagine. Yeah. And we love each other. We don't allow too much drama into this marriage. Um, if we do, we, you know, we talk things over. I got a little upset earlier and her and I worked it out. You know, we talk things through because we love each other and that's the right thing to do. But there's a lot of couples that, that live in that drama yeah. and uh, they live in the drama zone. It's not the twilight zone. Well, for some, it's, for some, it's the twilight zone, it <laughs> but it's the drama zone. <laughs> but... Um. A healthy marriage is, yes. is one where you guys are encouraging each other, loving each other, building each other up, saying kind words to one another, hugging each other, kissing each other, making love with each other. Woo, baby! <laughs> You're funny. Hey, guys, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Um, so we have Claudia um, and Honey. Thank you for that nice message. And we have Mary Jo is saying something, something. Oh, my cousin Missy was on. Hey, MJ. Hey, everybody. <laughs> She's like, oh, my gosh. Something, something. And <laughs> Anne-Marie keeps changing her name. I'm like so confused. She's now Kiana or something. Kina. Kina Howitz. Oh, she was Anne-Marie a I little while that, ago. Oh, we got your card, Anne-Marie. Thank is that you. Like, the picture. Is that Hawaiian? Is that Hawaiian? I think that's part of her last name that she broke up. That's my so guess. So Anne-Marie, Kina, Hawana, Mana, Mana? I think it's part of her her last name uh, broken down. But I don't know. I could be wrong. You need to explain that to us someday. <laughs> so we're... whoever, like we were saying earlier, whoever wants to come to Christmas Eve service. We love you though, Anne-Marie. Um, we'll be there tomorrow at 6 p.m. service. We're not serving tomorrow, so we're going to We are not serving because I'm working. I am on duty. Yeah. So Love makes the world go round. It sure does. Please be praying tomorrow that people don't drive crazy and I have an easy day. Yeah. He works <laughs> on the highway on 95 and all the, all the bad crashes. Today was nothing. And we're laughing. I had a slow day today, but <laughs> Christmas Eve can be a busy day. Believe it or not, the craziest holidays are... 
Fourth of July, which most people would think, but it's after midnight for Fourth of July. Mm -hmm. The two craziest holidays that I've ever worked fat fatalities on the highway and just had the craziest days have been Memorial Day and Labor Day. Mm -hmm. And that's because everybody's drinking, they're, everybody's off, and everybody's drinking all day. Yeah. It's yeah. nonstop. It's five o'clock all day, <laughs> everywhere. Five o'clock somewhere. And so those are the two craziest days. But Christmas Eve isn't usually too bad. So yeah. Yeah. Uh, Mary Joe says they're driving down south tomorrow night. Wish us luck. Oh, we'll awesome. We'll be praying for you. I'm glad you get to spend some time with your family. Come to church, MJ. Come yeah. to six o'clock. Yeah, we'll Hannah, Hannah is not no. going to be there. She says it's too late for the boys, um, which I don't know. She's been there before, but... Anyway, we're gonna miss them. We're hope we were hoping they could come with oh, us, but but we will see them Christmas Day, and uh, hopefully you guys will be yeah. able to catch up maybe when you're here, if you want to. And anything else? No, I think that's it. It's our fake Christmas tree. Wait, let me just try show some show them Oh, she's gonna show you. Oh, let me tell you something, okay. All right, babe. We didn't tell them the best part about the tree. What? Okay, the best part about the tree, guys, it's is this thing opens up like an umbrella. Okay, mm -hmm. that is the best part. So it comes in two, it comes in two pieces, and basically you you open it up, you pull the pieces down, and you clip the other one into it, and the lights automatically plug into each other, and you turn it on. And as you can see, you Dre's over there changing the colors, the and there's a there's a foot pad on the ground that allows her to change the colors. So. Okay, okay. Oh, a little better. She, she wants you to see the ambient the ambiance or ambiance. Oh, the late lightsaber. <laughs> Oh, hold it, hold it. Oh, yes. That, look at, okay, you guys, look. That is his wall of stuff. He's got a, what is that white guy? Stormtrooper? Stormtrooper. You got Darth Vader. You can see the red, the red lights is coming out of him. Is he too funny? Lightsaber duel between you and the Laras. Oh, yes, we have to. And we got a gun, my little guns up here. My old, my old fashioned uh, gun, which is for my friend Shane, who passed away last, last and Christmas. And that's, um, Sean bought me that stand-up desk. It moves up and down. Show him real quick. So I can stand or sit for work. Isn't yep. that cool? It's so cool. It's so and, wa and watch this. Hey, Google, make desk pink. Oh, how uh, that's white. Oh, that's hey, Google, blue. make desk fuchsia. Hey, Google, make desk fuchsia. It's confused. Hey, Google, make oh, that. Oh, there it, it is. Did it. Okay. There it goes. Cool. Anyway, you can change color. <laughs> when she uses a desk, and make it pink for her. Oh. So... All right, so they can see the tree now. I made it blue. Isn't oh, you that made the cool? tree blue? Isn't that pretty? Well, I made it all different colors, actually. Okay. There it is. And it goes back and forth, too. Yeah. And My desk at work went out again, to the customer there. Again, make sure you guys check this out. I'm giving you a preview Ooh, of the video. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Doesn't that look good? <laughs> that's it's what we made. That's what's going to be in our video. We made some of it with this stuff. Keto flower. Yep. Hey, Danny. How are we you? We made some of this. Thanks for stopping by. And... Guys, check out, if you haven't done this, Jesus Couples is on Instagram. Um, my, way, my Instagram just changed to My Digital Disciple, so if you're looking for me, that's where I am. Um, on Facebook, the Facebook group is Jesus Couples, and you can go to Digital Disciple, which is found at facebook.com forward slash groups forward slash My Digital Disciple. So anyway, that's kind of where everything is. So anyway, what was I going to say? There's one group out there that... It's not really, oh, Jesus Couples is probably the, we have probably 150 people, I think, in the, the Digital Disciple group and the Keto, um, Low Carb Keto Friendly group. But the Jesus Couples one, we have half as many, because I think half as many singles are like, they keep sending me messages. Well, can I join? I'm like, yeah, you yeah, can, join. can join. Please join. Yeah. <laughs> so oh I just thought it was cool having Jesus's name next to the word couples, because that's what, that's what we need to make a relationship work as a couple. Yeah. Jesus is the key to a happy marriage. And yes. so I thought that was cool. So anyway. So Anne-Marie's kids are hysterical with this video and we're so funny and so much st stimulation right now. <laughs> hey, you know what? We like... There's nothing there's to do, the you know? we got to keep each other occupied. <laughs> we're hey, we're nesters, just, you know, no. we're just a little crazy <laughs> over here, you know? I'm just saying... And this is like without alcohol, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, I talked about it being five o'clock somewhere earlier. Oh, that's right. So. All right, well, we good. Hi, Paula. How are you? Just wanted to wish everybody a Merry Christmas. Showing off my, my tree. Oh, Mandy Moore is on. Where's Fritz? Ooh. Oh, my gosh. Is he sure? Sometimes he will hide behind 
oh, like the wall, like a door or something, and jump out and scare me. You haven't done that in a while. Thank you very much. I, I appreciate haven't. that. It used to make me mad. Thanks for reminding me. It makes me mad when he scares me. Hey, man, uh, Mandy, and hey, Christina, how are you? Merry Christmas. Um, we just did a food video. <laughs> she goes, you want a few ideas to keep you busy? Well, we already know how to do that. Look at this guy. Yes, these are the uh, Captain Crunch chicken tenders you're looking for over there. Over there, yeah. Is he a trip, you guys? Oh my goodness. Merry Christmas! <laughs> <laughs> what a, that's too funny. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I have this one too. Oh, he's sleeping? I can wear this. <laughs> I can wear this. We're going to Disney next week and maybe I should wear Artie Duty. We are going to Disney for my mom's, her mother-in-law's 70th, 70th birthday. And it's going to be the whole gang, Fidel and Teresa Pray for us. and Tiana and us Pray. all in one condo in Magic Kingdom. Oh my gosh. Those people at Magic Kingdom don't know what hit them yet. <laughs> let me tell you. Um, hi, uh, happy Jesus birthday. Yes. Oh, Christina, thank you for the anniversary. Um, wish we had an awesome time at the and beach. And Christmas Day, we'll be wearing our matching. Christmas flannel mask. We've got matching masks. That's right. You know, some people actually look better with a mask on. Have oh you guys noticed goodness. that? I look so much younger. I think I just went 20 years younger. Um, so. We're only going to be in Orlando for two days. Okay, one last thing. I have to show you guys these. Oh, these yeah. are so cute. Look what, how cute. Nessies? Aren't they do adorable? Hopefully they're nothing satanic. This is the boy and this is the girl. <laughs> hey, what girl have you, hey, do you know has a beard like hey, that? Put her down, uh, what? Like I'm that. just saying. I thought it was supposed to stay up. Um, so we saw these in um, oh, a, a Lifetime Christmas movie, and I fell in love with them. So <laughs> this one we got first. Isn't he cute? And his little body is like glitter. And then this one has got pink. So I had to get a boy and a girl. So I'm the one over here, the green oh, one boy. that looks like a uh, Look, weeble, wa cute? weeble wobble. Look at how cute. And she's got like sparkles in her hat. Give me a kiss. <laughs> Give me a kiss. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> We're so oh, crazy. She matches my outfit. See? She does. Look, my little baby. Look, he matches my outfit too. I got like white on my sleeves. There you go. I got him at TJ Maxx, like $9, I think. That they was were. Ross, I think. No, it was TJ Maxx with that your one? mom. Yeah, both, oh, both of them. Yeah, I this think. one's TJ. Aren't they cute? I personally, oh I'm goodness. kind of a snob. I like TJ better than Marshall's and Ross. I don't well, know Ross why. Ross is a little. TJ's got like least name brands that I yeah. recognize. And it's affordable. Why so. pay full price? But. Right? Definitely. All right. Well, now that we've uh, showed you all of our toys yeah. that keeps us entertained. Yeah, we've showed you our toys. <laughs> Maybe we'll put this Facebook Live video if she remembers to save it. We'll put I'll it at the it. we'll put it at the end of the oh, yeah. of the YouTube video when I put the YouTube video on there. Um, which I believe I can do. Um, I might need prayers on that one. <laughs> Cause You'll do good. I'm learning, I'm so learning, I'm learning, so I'm learning good. all this stuff. You made an app. I can't even believe you did that. It's well, so I, awesome. I made an app, but I hired somebody to make yeah, the app. Yeah, but you put it all together. But I made the website, and I specifically made it so the the app would update when I updated the website. That was the plan. So, uh -huh. but yeah, I hired somebody to do it though, and I designed it the way I wanted wait, it. I want to show them the white. Oh, wait. That, but that goes white. I'm trying to get it changed to the new website now, and the it's company who white. made it is not returning, oh. they're, they're sending me emails back and forth forever, yeah. and uh, Isn't they it, haven't updated it. it. The beard is messing with my brain and the sheet. I know, right? What is it? Oh. <laughs> I know. Yeah, how can this be a girl? I agree. It's just the, because they can be boy and girl. Let me see. Let me, no, get out wait, of here. Hold it, what's this little Get out of chin? here, get out of here. Do you guys <laughs> like the tree with the white? Isn't the white pretty? Look how gorgeous this is. Yeah. Is that beautiful? It's seven and a half feet. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. With the stormtrooper in the back. Now bathroom. you guys see my wrestling belt back there. That's because I am the champion. I'm the wrestling champion of the house. <laughs> That's right. I, I am the wrestling champion of the house. And then Darth Vader, we just found at TJ Maxx. And then our cross says it is well with my soul. Mm -hmm. And then if you guys can see the S and the A, they're probably backwards. Yeah. But it means Sean loves Andrea. No. Of course, if you guys, you guys, you sweet? guys are smart. You figured you guys, that out. They, they figured that out. <laughs> they got it all. They got it all down. All right, well, we got to go clean up our mess from cooking, and I want to eat another chicken tender, even though we're past fasting time. Um, I'm not eating any more chicken tenders. Oh, maybe I should But this either. is what they look like. They're so good, you guys. They are oh yummy. Oh, gosh. You guys got to watch our video on how we made them. And if you, so good. If you guys do get a chance to go to Orlando, um, Guy Ferrari has a menu actually oh, yeah. on the 
Planet Hollywood. Planet Hollywood's still there. It's just not a club anymore. Yeah, it's just um, a restaurant. It's really just a restaurant. It was pretty dead when we were there. Um, we also went to the Chicken Guy restaurant next door, mm -hmm. which some people say they like it. Some people say they don't. But um, I got to have the peanut butter chicken tender or peanut, what is it? Captain Crunch chicken yeah. tenders when we were there. <laughs> so I may make them next time with peanut butter Captain Crunch. Oh, that sounds That's good. That's an idea. And I've also seen them made with cinnamon crunch toast, Ooh. which I don't know. But anyway. Was there cereal left over? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's cereal okay, left over. And, and there's milk left over. It's, oh, it's Christmas. If you'd like to come over on Christmas Eve and have some Captain Crunch with my wife. Oh, we're going to do the come, fire pit tomorrow come night. Come on too. over. Yeah, we will have the fire pit going tomorrow night. If you just want to randomly stop by, we'll be here. We'll be here after, after church. that After the church, yeah. after 6 o'clock service. Yeah. So, again, we're not serving, so we will be here. All right, guys. Hanging out. Is that it? I think that's it, babe. All right. Hey, well, we love you. We're going to pray you out real quick. Go ahead. Lord God, we just pray for everybody out there that's watching. We just pray a special blessing for them. We thank you for our friends. We thank you for our family. Whoever sees this video later on down the road, we just pray they you know, won't think we're crazy, but hopefully they'll, they'll know that we're just a couple who loves you and loves each other. And I just pray, Lord Jesus, that you would just bless our marriage and bless all the marriages out there, Lord God, in your name, Jesus. And keep, singles. And the singles, keep, your, keep, keep them pure, Father God. Have them wait for the perfect person that you have for them. Mm -hmm. And just bless our brothers and sisters and keep us healthy and safe. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Love you guys. All right, guys. God bless. Have a good night. Merry Christmas. Bye. We love you guys. Bye. Bye.